Hi, Dr. Rich Boyardo here, uh, Cross County Orthopedics here in West Orange, New Jersey. I'm a joint reconstructive orthopedic surgeon, primarily trained in New York City, originally from Jersey, not too far from here. Born in Newark, New Jersey, uh, raised in the suburbs. I had the privilege of attending Georgetown University Medical School in New York, training in New York, Boston, LA, and Seattle. Had the privilege of training with Dr. Larry Dore in Los Angeles, one of the greats in joint replacement arthroplasty. Our practice is here in West Orange, centered on arthritis surgery, joint replacement with some orthopedic trauma, and general orthopedics, sports medicine as well. It's our privilege to come back to the area we were from, helping people with their arthritic problems. People come in relatively immobile, they have the surgery or the regenerative cell injection, and they're walking again. Tremendous source of gratification. Currently, I'm the Chief of Orthopedics at Hoboken University Medical Center and Chief at Christ Hospital as well. I do a fair amount of urban orthopedics. We have a very challenging patient population. One of my particular challenges in orthopedics was the relationships of various bones and orientations of the joint replacement. I was very privileged to have worked construction for four or five years in my early career, which helps with spatial relations and mating the particular joint together in the proper alignment. In 2009, as you can see on the poster, we brought Mako Robotics to New Jersey. Robotic unicompartmental and total hip replacement initially. I was working with the Mako Corporation before Stryker bought them. So we've been doing robotics in some way, shape or form for the last 15 years. The cutting edge of robotics puts a different tenor to joint replacement. It's much more accurate, precise, less blood loss to the surgery, quicker recovery. But also now we're very involved and have been on the cutting edge of regenerative stem cells, which hopefully can even keep people away from the operating room, especially athletes, people in their midlife who have arthritic hips and knees and wish to wait a little bit longer before they avail themselves of the total hip and knee replacement or total shoulder replacement. Joint replacement particularly is a life-changing exercise. You have an arthritic problem, whether the patient was an ex-athlete, laborer, construction worker, executive, with post-traumatic arthritic change in the hip, knee, or shoulder, patients come in with severe deformity, restricted range of motion, inability to sleep through the night, failing conservative management, they go to surgery, and again, with the precision of robotics and computer navigation at times, we implant a joint in perfect orientation, allow the joint to be implanted with minimal blood loss, most patients leave the hospital same day or next day. When I first started in this business, when my hair was dark, people would stay in the hospital two to three weeks for total hip and knee replacement. That's unheard of now. My average length of stay is same day or overnight stay. Very, very gratifying, very exciting. What Cross County Orthopedics is all about is patient care. I like to say we have cutting edge technology and we do in the framework of traditional patient care, which we're all taught way back when we took the Hippocratic Oath. We have great people at the front desk, great booking people. The experience is very pleasant from the walk through the door to the initial evaluation, diagnostic workup, surgery if appropriate, stem cell injections if appropriate, all the way through the post-operative therapy and post-operative care. We consider this a totality of experience, which is very patient-centric, efficient, cutting edge oriented, but even with the latest cutting edge technology, the whole experience is primarily patient centric. It's all about the patient and that's it. Mm -hmm.